Hello students, this is your English creative writing class. Today we are going to solve exercise 13 from book 4. So we start our lesson. Page number 115. Here is A part. Complete the following sentences. Example. If I save enough money, I will buy the whole series of my favorite comics. 1. If, if I get the highest marks in class, I will go to Disneyland this holiday. 2. If, if I watch television in the afternoon, I will not complete my homework. 3. If If I get first position in grade 4. 4. If If I visit to my grandparents, I will feel happy. 5. If If I lose my favorite toy, I will cry. 6. If If I win in the art competition, I will be so proud of myself. B. Use your imagination to complete the following sentences. Example. If I were Superman, I would help to maintain world peace. 1. If I were the president, I would provide food and shelter to the poor people. 2. If I were the most powerful robot, I would get rid of all the diseases and criminals in the world. 3. If I were the captain of a cruise ship, I would sail for Europe. 4. If I were a coach of a national football team, I would train my team hard. 5. If I were Spider-Man, I would climb up to K2. 6. If I were an alien, I would invite people on Earth to my planet. C. If you had a million dollars, what would you do? Make a list of 10 ways of spending or using this fortune. 1. Help those people whose homes are destroyed. 2. Donate to child's home. 3. Build a hospital for poor. 4. Build a school and provide free education. 5. Distribute food among needy people. 6. Go on a cruise. 7. Buy a new house. 8. By my sister her favorite toys. 9. Give my parents some money. 10. Save some money in bank. D. How would you act in the following situations? Use your imagination to complete each paragraph. 1. You were studying alone at home late one night. Suddenly, there was a blackout. You were in a pitch dark room. Your parents were not home and you had no idea where the torch lights or candles were. I decided to find my way out of the room. I checked outside to see other house. I also called my parents to tell them what happened. 2. You were at the supermarket alone. Just as you were ready to pay at the checkout counter, you realized you had forgotten to bring your wallet. There was a long queue behind you. The cashier had already started to add up the items. I hurriedly... Uh, I hurriedly asked her to stop. I told her that I had forgotten my wallet at home by mistake. 
I asked her to leave my things in the basket and told that I would return to the supermarket to pay for them in one hour. 3. You were taking a test when you noticed your best friend Jim looking at some papers secretively. You realized Jim was cheating. I kicked him and told him not to copy my notes. When he did not notice, I became angry and started shouting. When the teacher came, I told to her about his cheating. The teacher scolded him and changed his seat. I was happy. Fourth, after a football match, you went home to take a shower. While you shampooed your hair, some shampoo got into your eyes. You reached for the tap. There was no water. You shouted, but nobody answered you. I took towel and tried to wipe my eyes. Then I opened the tap to check water. There was still no water. I came outside and went straight to the kitchen where I got two jugs full of water. Then I returned to the bathroom and washed off and washed off the shampoo. E. Writing task. You met face to face with a tiger which had just escaped from the zoo. To your astonishment, it spoke to you. Imagine your conversation with the tiger. Use these questions to help you. Brainstorming guidelines. 1. How did you feel when you first saw the tiger? I was scared. 2. What did the tiger try to say to you? It was trying to find way to the forest so that it could look for its friends. 3. Did you decide to help the tiger? Yes, I decided to help the tiger. 4. What did you have to do? I led it to show where to go. 5. What happened in the end? The tiger found the forest. 6. Did anybody believe your story? No. Now, with the help of the guidelines, write a short story of at least 100 words on your strange experience with the tiger. Give your story a suitable title. Last Friday, I was back from my school to home. I met a tiger lying sadly near a tree. I was much scared to see it. The tiger begged me for help. It told me that it had escaped from zoo and could not find way to forest. I led it to show the way to forest. It was very happy. It tried to introduce me with its friends like squirrel, lion, monkey. But I was afraid of going into the deep forest. So I came back quickly. When I told this event to my friends, no one believed me. F. Practice in creative writing. Our emotions affect the colors we choose. Try the following exercise. Compare your answers with those of your friends. What color do you think of if? 1. You are scolded by your parents. Black. 2. You win the first prize in a singing competition. Yellow. 3. Your best friend transfers to another school. Blue. 4. You have a nightmare. White. 5. Have the most wonderful dream. Orange. 6. You feel dizzy. Gray. You were not in a good mood and you had to attend the art class. In about 100 words, write about why you were not in a good mood and what you drew and the colors you used in the art class. I was in bad mood during art competition last Saturday. My younger sister rode my bicycle without my permission and crashed it into lamp 
post. My bicycle was bent and it was no lo longer in use. During the art competition, Mrs. Joan told us to draw circles and paint in any color you want. I drew some circles and painted them in black colors. Then I painted the background in gray color. My whole paper looked gloomy, just my mood. Thanks for listening. For new videos, don't forget to subscribe my channel. And if you like my videos, please share and like.